Hey Sandra, what's the capital of Thailand? We are in Bangkok for three days and I am taking you along with me starting with the Grand Palace. How does it feel to have a dress code in Sandra? Right? I think yeah. you get it. I feel the struggle. I feel the struggle. <laughs> We decided to return back to the Grand Palace tomorrow when we have one more time to spare and two, Sandro can wear some pants. You can buy pants inside, it's 200 baht for the men's like elephant pants. Um, and it does close within an hour. So we are just gonna scratch this and come back tomorrow. And so now we are going to a globally inspired mall. Terminal 21 is a multi-story retail and lifestyle area with a new theme on every floor. The design pays tribute to the most popular destinations around the world from Morocco to San Francisco. We made it to dry land. So now I'm gonna do a nice little B-roll sequence of watch a run in three, two, one. shopping area. We found all sorts of goodies. We are about to try... Have you ever had hot dog on a stick? Well, it's that, but with mozzarella cheese inside. We're just waiting for it to come out. Um, and then we'll probably just keep eating our way around Science Square. That's an odd one. Isn't that odd? Good morning. I was not going to record this morning because your girl got two hours of sleep, but um, I decided, you know, let's get this day started with a bang. Um, we are on, we are waiting for the shuttle to pick us up, or the bus to pick us up. See, I can't even talk this morning. Uh, to pick us up and take us to the floating market. And I actually think that they're here. Floating market, right? Yes. Hey, see? They're here. No time to wait. Let's go. So we made it to the Meiklong train market, which is famous for the train that comes through, obviously, the market. Um, I'm really tired, so I stopped off for coffee. This was 40 baht, iced coffee. This is the red line, you just stand behind in order for the train to pass through. Known as the first floating market in Thailand and quite possibly the biggest, Damnon Saduwak offers shoppers a ton of unique finds from pillowcases to rice hats. So far my bargaining skills are not working. <laughs> Five minutes later. Thank God for Google Maps. So yeah, it's either a 20 minute car ride or a 29 minute walk. 1.4 miles, mostly flat. Start. Off to Chinatown. Okay, we made it to our bus stop. 